Microsoft has announced that Windows 10 is now running on more than 600 million active devices. The list of devices includes desktops, tablets, Xbox One consoles, HoloLens headsets, and Surface Hub devices, in addition to some dated Windows 10 mobile-based smartphones. The new figure is significantly higher than the 270 million user base that had emerged in March last year, but is lower than the original aim of 1 billion users. As Geekwire reports that CEO Satya Nadella made the announcement at Microsoft's annual shareholders meeting on Wednesday. Nadella highlighted the development of differentiated solutions, instead of merely targeting at desktops or mobile devices. This approach would give the Redmond giant to expand its user base new levels. Microsoft will continue to deliver differentiated solutions using new technologies like cloud, artificial intelligence, and mixed reality to empower our customers to grow and thrive, the India-born executive said. Geekwire mentioned that Microsoft acknowledged at the annual meeting that it wouldn't able to reach the goal of 1 billion Windows 10 users within two to three years of the platform's launch in 2015. A promise that Microsoft's Terry Meyerson had made at the time of launching Windows 10. Just a couple of months after the original release of Windows 10 back in July 2015, Microsoft reached the benchmark of 50 million users. The free upgrade offered to let Windows 7 and Windows 8.1 users experience the latest Windows platform helped the company expand the user base in a short span of time. However, since the tempted offer was available only for a limited period, the company probably wasn't able to attract enough number of fresh Windows 10 users to meet its target. Having said that, Microsoft is enabling new features on Windows 10 to expand its reach. The team led by Nadella lately developed features such as an airdrop like NearShare, native app tabbing with sets, and visualizing history with timeline. All these features are likely to persuade users to start using the latest Windows platform in the coming future.